Mudge again. Hammers this one to center. And it's gone. Kaylee Mudge had no home runs on the year coming into today. She now has two. Three home runs in the inning for Florida State. And this is very odd to see. A base hit. A hit that does not leave the yard. 2-1 to Harding. Harding right up the middle into the wall. Beats him to third. Florida just piece this together. They can do it with the long ball. They've done it all weekend long, but they can also do it gap to gap. This really is the offense that will stand the test of time offensively through the latter part of this season is can you shorten your swing and can you work down line drive through contact? And the answer is yes, this team can. Runner goes, they do throw down and get her. Runners on the corners, why not give a throw, get the pitch. They have to get better. Jordan George at the plate with the full count. In there for a strike three call. First strike out of the day. From Flights if you want to catch her or just watch on the ACC network. Here's Esparza, they're watching at home. Watching her hit this one off the wall. is going to stumble into second base. And slide in there for the double. They've been taking the slow trip around the bases. How about Anna Hernandez to center field? And a two-run shot. Pitt with their first round stripper of the weekend. They're going to try and make this one a game. Second home run of the season for Hernandez. Oh my gosh, so timely for this team, trying their best to scratch and claw to get out of running the territory. They've been running twice this weekend. But there is still life in this pit offense. You go back to the importance of KK. Hernandez are hitting and been struggling a little bit, but maybe that'll get him going. Hannah Greer, nice stop there from Beecham. It's a nice glove work there at the hot corner. Two away here in the second. Just has struggled a little bit offensively, hitting 077 coming into today. Now down 0 2 in the count to Royalty. Got her. Second strikeout of the inning. Is out, and it's less about perfection with Enfield and more about hard contact. That's the focus for her this year. Now it hit her on the elbow. There's some hard contact that she probably wasn't looking Ouch. for. The solo home run and a triple against Texas Tech. And hammers this one to right center field and over the glove of ball. Rounding second, Enfield into third, Ross. Kerr up the middle. Hernandez up with it, run does score. RBI ground down for Kerr. And it's 6-2, to two, Florida State. Her sixth of the season, now up with a runner at third. And she hammers this one down the left field line. Hamilton giving chase. Ross comes in to easily score. How about another extra base hit for Hallie Waycase? Torres to second, it goes right through Rodriguez. Coming in to score from second is Waycaser. And we will score that as an error as Torres reaches first. Another play that just has to be made. Should be a routine out. Pitt unable to make that defensive play we again we saw this in passing it this weekend 12 home runs on the weekend for florida state and the hits just keep on coming that is hit number nine
This one up the middle, flip to second, throws the first double play. Hernandez to Rodriguez to Cobson. Could have been much worse. 2-0 here to Rodriguez. Round ball. Third baseman Torres. Pretty smooth. One away. Very determined athlete at the plate. There to beach him. Two away. The buck 85 entering the day. The one two. Ramirez that drops in front of the left fielder nudge. Two out base hit. Just trying to get into that groove offensively. Throw down. It's late. Great. I'm. Big pitch, full count. Cobson, we saw her hit a home run against Florida State three years ago. How about doing it again? Two-run shot, her sixth of the season. And Pitt says we're not going away quietly. If I'm Coach Allard, I am really loving the adjustments you're seeing at the plate. It might have taken a couple games, but this is how you grow. This is what you look at when you're establishing yourself as a new head coach at this program is what can we build upon? These are the moments. It's not just the home runs, but it's the fact that your team is setting the table for you. Right? It's that double from a spark and fight here in game three. Oh, the ground out was supposed to end the inning. Instead, it goes through the second baseman, Flaherty, and he started the College World Series. Gave up just one hit against Washington. Ball gets away, runner in easily. Good George slides in easily. The fifth run of the game now. Up there on locations, also mixed with the speed, right? You've got to have so much reaction behind the plate, catching this arm. Esparza to deep center field and gone! KK Esparza, her second home run of the season. And the third of the day for Pitt. We got a ball game. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I don't know if we've mentioned to it yet, but it's Bark in the Park, and there's a lot of dogs eating right now at the plate. Holy cow, seven home runs in this game. This is high heat left over the middle of the strike zone, and Esparza makes her pay. Again, go back to the setup of Pitt. The error at second base gives way for the at-bat. And now five straight batters have reached with two outs in this inning for Pitt. Count. From the sophomore to the freshman. In there for a called strike three. We go to the fourth. Florida State. For the <laughs> Without being pretty outstanding as a freshman. Especially in Florida State. What a play. Rodriguez, diving stop. Put a star on that one. One out. Harding, the short. The defense continues to shine. All oh, the foot off the base. The throw from Hernandez to Cubson off of the base. Head and field. Hits behind the runner and a nice job through the right side. Nearly out in second base is like, oh, excuse me here, Harding. Taking all the way at a four pitch walk, and the bases are now loaded. Her stepping in, she's still in her body. Oh, she swung and missed. It hits the whole plate umpire. And with the drop third, stepping on first, 
Home plate umpire Tyler Daffron just took it right in the hand, and you could tell from the moment it hit him that hurt. Ugh, right on the knuckle. Oh, ah. my goodness. Oh. That hurts just. Home plate umpire in decent shape, and so is Florida State. That one off the wall. Waycaser delivers again. Quick work, steps in the box, one pitch, one swing. This one is letter high right down Broadway. One hops the fence, collects two RBIs, quick work. Again, we're just seeing FSU do their job. Consistent. That one gets behind the catcher, runner from third not going in the form of Amaya Ross. Waycaser now a triple shy of the Four run lead for Florida State. Two more out there in scoring position for Torres, who has a home run today. Off speed, waves through it. Second strikeout of the inning for Braden. An ERA of under one. This ball puts that one over the third baseman, Beecham's head. Mudge up with it, throws it into second base. But for Elena Ball, who was hitting 077 to come. Been competing on the international stage. The age of 15. This one to right field. Way Kaser. Drops in front to second base. Ball goes through. And Pitt. Has I believe that's Harding playing right field. Here's now. Hamilton who puts the bunt down beats and throws to first for the out, but it does the job now two in scoring position Full count Swing and a miss big one from Reed The one one Thompson skies this one to right Harding under it and makes the catch that I have two dogs myself. It was just okay. an observation. I wasn't judging. I like cats no. too, but no, it's it's okay to judge every once in a while as long as you hold yourself to the same town lab. So our hands are full over here too. Very much has two home runs today. She's not getting a third, is she? No. Ooh. Hamilton grabs it for the first out. Now, Jay Sonny beats him. Runner goes. Flaherty in there with her ninth stolen base of the season. Beats him. Oh, it was only a matter of time. She ropes that one. She was hugging the third baseline with those shots, those foul balls. Look at Beecham with the heads up base running. Gets into second base. Harding flares this one to center. Going to make the catch is Ball tagging from third and scoring is Flaherty. It's 11 6. It's enough to get the job done. Just got to find the green in order to snag the RBI. It's a good catch from Ball in center field. <laughs> 3 2 to end field from Brayton. In the dirt, she walked. This was six home runs on the season. Pitt has hit four, excuse me, Florida State has hit four of them today. And Ross going deep, and there it is! Number five on the day for Florida State. And Amaya Ross puts Florida State in run rule territory in the fifth. I mean, wow. You knew Amaya was thinking it, right? You knew that she knew what that at bat could be, and she does it. That's that professionalism that we heard from Coach Alameda about this bat. What she brings to the plate is all business. How about this all business approach? How about Johnny Kerr? 
Now everybody's got a hit today for Florida State. Home run number six for the Knowles. What a weekend. What a weekend for Florida State. This is a weekend, this is a series that you put a star by and you look back on you say, this was really the weekend that we put some juice back in the tank, that we really figured some things out, that we swung fearless. There's a home run, a double, and a single. There's only one left at the knees. Close I'll play pitch. I'll play. He can't chase it out of the zone. Dak to left. Is this leaving the yard? You bet. Katie Dak gets in on the act. First home run of the year. Holy cow. Holy cow. Matt, do you realize what we've seen so far in this game? Mudge collects her first home run of the season, then goes back to back with two bombs. Dak with a pinch hit. Her first bomb of the season. Seven home runs on the night for Florida State. Amazing. An amazing offensive performance and an 11 run lead here. Jordan George. George hammers this one to right. Is that gone? Come on. Come on. Holy cow. George, George, her first home run of her career. <laughs> the freshman gets it done. Holy cow. I hope you guys aren't going anywhere because there's some fun stuff happening in this game three matchup. My goodness, a game of firsts. A game of offense, Jordan George, the first home run of her career. And there's still life for Pitt. Ground ball the third, Beecham has been auto matting. Oh, with the nice scope, had some help from a friend. Amaya Ross, smile from Beecham, my fault, my Five temps. Yeah, that's frigid. <laughs> that's, uh, that's frigid. Here we go again. I mean, just speaking from the offensive side. A freshman outfielder trying to keep him alive to right, right into the mitt of the right fielder, Kennedy Harp now. Florida State. Ground ball to short, up with it. Torres with the out. And Florida State with the series sweep. What a game three. A 17 to seven win for Florida State. It was a four home run outing for Pitt to build off of. And for Florida State, no midweek, a chance to take a breath chance to get on your field and practice before you turn around and face NC State. What a game three. Yeah, that was Potter with the last assist.